Oh, yo DP, what's up? Same here. You know, I was wondering, let me ask you a question. How many of you are interested in either screenwriting or filmmaking? Well, then the 10 10 10 student filmmaking and screenwriting competition is for you. In the 10 10 10 student screenplay writing and filmmaking competition, 10 students are chosen to, writ to write 10 screenplays, each student with a professional screenplay writer in their field. Subsequently, 10 students are chosen to produce a film to go along with each screenplay. This competition has been going on for a number of years, and in the past, many students have been chosen as finalists and have actually competed in this competition who go to Dos Pueblos. I encourage everyone out there who has any kind of interest in filmmaking and or writing to participate in this year's 101010 10 competition. To participate in the screenwriting contest, submit a 10-page sample of your best writing work to Mr. Dent by October 4th. That deadline is coming up soon. That's this Wednesday. 10 minute sample to Mr. Dent. Five screenwriters will be chosen from throughout all the high schools in the district and five college screenwriters as well. If you would like to participate in this year's 10 10 10 filmmakers competition, all you have to do is submit a five minute sample of your best filmmaking work to Mr. Dent. The deadlines for submitting your best screenplay is October 4th, this Wednesday, coming up. The deadline for submitting your best filmmaker's work is November 1st, to Mr. Dent. I'm Kobe Coffer, and you're watching Kobe's Corner. On a similar note, the other day I got to hit the clubs in a little segment I like to call Kobe's Clubbing Corner. Hey, yo, DP, I'm Kobe Coffer, standing here in the Good Food Club in M3, Wednesday afternoon at lunch with Ethan Breyer. Ethan Breyer, I've heard that name before just now. Tell me about how, what you love about the Good Food Club. Is it the good food or is it the friends? Is it the family? Is it the... You know, we just love eating good food and talking about good food and being a part of Good Food Club. It's the best club on campus. Anything else you would love to add to this interview? Yeah, we're having a chip and dip party right now. More to come with that. So just, you know, come to M3 on Wednesdays. There's bound to be some good food there and some great times and great friends as well. What do you love about debating in the debate club particularly? Well, it's really fun. We have just enough organization to make it great, but not so much that it gets all structured and rigid. And we get to compete against others and have a great time and learn a whole bunch of valuable life skills that we can use pretty much every day, like whether we're asking our boss for a raise or telling off our friend as to why he's wrong, that kind of thing. I'd debate that point. <laughs> well, you'd be wrong, you see, because it, it's been... Thank you. <laughs> I'm Kobe Coffer, standing here with Miss Tabby, right? I'm Tabby Magner. And we're at the Ukulele Club, meeting on Tuesdays in A1, right? Every Tuesday in A1. So Tabby, tell me a little bit about the Ukulele Club. What do you do here exactly? Our goal is to teach kids who wanna are interested and want to learn the ukulele how to play. So we're fundraising a lot, like we have a luau coming up for whoever wants to come, and we're going to try to buy a bunch of ukes and teach people how to play them. I'll be there. Tuesdays at A1. And you should too. Thank you very much. Wow. <laughs> What's your favorite part of ukuleles? Uh, <laughs> the strings? I don't know. 